Scotty Reed here, founder and president of the Black Talk Media Project. And I operate a um, number of different media platforms, social media platforms, and then podcasting, and also digital radio stations, all done through the nonprofit Black Talk Media Project. Um, so I also am involved as a community organizer, activist, and I also engage in First Amendment of uh, freedom of the press activities. And so I'm not just a content creator on social media, but I also try to help make my community that I live in better. How can I talk about what's going on around the world or in the nation and then ignore the things happening in my community? And I sometimes have to do more than just report on what's going on in the community. But, you know, a situation arose where I had to... Um, stand on the Constitution, both the North Carolina Constitution and the U.S. Constitution, you know, in terms of freedom of assembly on a public sidewalk, in, in terms of freedom of, to protest, the freedom of the press for me to be able to cover a protest. And I was arrested because as I was covering the protest for the uh, murder, as the community alleges, and evidence would suggest, I would add, of Jason Lipscomb um, by Gastonia Police officers and maybe some additional officers uh, from the Gaston County Sheriff's Department who arrested me um, for standing on the sidewalk and refusing to get off the sidewalk. So that's where my mug shot photo that I uploaded uh, came from. And so a comment that I got was uh, from a person saying, well, law enforcement told me to move. Well, this comes down to, are you a slave or are you a citizen? You know, citizens pay taxes, citizens own property, citizens pay the salaries of public employees and law enforcement uh, at the end of the day are public employees. So either they work for me or they don't. Um, only slaves, you know, allow their rights to be violated without protesting whatsoever. Slaves do what they're told to do. And in case you didn't know, slavery allegedly ended in 1865. Um, although there is an exception in the 13th Amendment and the North Carolina Constitution where it leaves it as uh, legal as punishment for crime. Um, but we're talking about mentalities. If I got to get arrested and, and be subjected to 21st century slavery uh, as a free person standing up to tyranny, then so be it. But, you know, people like this person who's saying they told me to move and I deserve to get arrested See, that's a slave mentality. Or this could be a suspected racist, and because of my skin color, they think I'm supposed to jump when law enforcement says jump. All right.